So here we go. Um, this is Bob Hooper, and I am leader of the uh, video, the leader of the video team. And I am, we're here today to put together a video draft. So do you guys see my, um, my desktop? Yes. Okay, good, perfect. So I, I have loaded DaVinci Resolve here. So, so you can see here, I'm, I'm, I'm firing it up right now. So a little bit about DaVinci Resolve. It's a free video editing software. It is, first of all, free. And second off, it is, it is very powerful. It is very, um, I am really impressed with the software. That it, it, it's got a lot of power potential and the, the, the third thing about it is that it gives the power to edit videos to everyone who's out there who wants to put together a video and doesn't know anything about it without having to purchase anything and um, the thing that, that that makes it better than than that is um, is is that you can start editing videos and let's say you had a problem or something like that. You, you can share your project with, with someone else. Um, and, and then they'll take it, all, take it over from you. So I, I, we, we've been, this is something that's been like a dream of mine that anyone can do a video for the weekend video and, and then move forward and, and with, and, and try it out, and if they stumble and fall, they can pass it on to someone else. Um, it's not like it, it's video editing is is it shouldn't be that hard, and, and 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 this 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 makes it more inviting of an environment for others. So right here, this is I, I turn it on, and it says. You got choices of projects here that I've, I've been playing with this a lot. So it makes, it gives you an option to uh, untitled project. So we're gonna make a new project here. You guys see my, so I'm starting a new project here. So this is the uh, screen here of DaVinci Resolve. And we have different screens here. And along the bottom, I don't know if you guys can follow my mouse, but I'm, I'm at the bottom of the screen. So this is this is the, the, the furthest one to the um, to the left here. So, yeah, that left is where you start your project. And this is this is this is sort of the uh, the media, the the file manager, sort of like the sort of like this thing. You know, I mean, this, this, this is a file manager for your computer. This is the file manager for DaVinci Resolve. So let's, uh, I'm click, clicking over here and I'm right clicking and it says add location. Can you see that, Laurie? Can you see that? Um, I'm kind of have a black screen, but I'm on my phone because ah, so. Okay. All right. So I mean, I I I see it when when it's I can see it, and right now it's all black. All like, black. Okay. Share. Okay. So let me do this. Share. So there, there's panels yeah. here. You see some different. Yes. Okay. So there's panels here to the left. And the, the first to the left is um, all these file locations. And then you can add a location here. And what I have set up is a, a Google Drive with Clara's video information. So um, share screen. Let's see if we get this. So it's a uh, Clara's uh, video information here. So, uh, select 
select uh, fold, um, select folder. So what we're getting here, oops. Oh, wait, I didn't add it. I'm gonna join it. Okay, here we go. Google Drive. So it's already in there, actually. So now, uh, let me see here. If we got this back. Here, screen. Share. So Claire, I put together a video draft here. And do you do you see do you see the the images that popped up over the images? Yes. Mm -hmm, cool. Thanks. So what you do here, and we're going to grab all these and slide them down to the bottom of the screen like that. Oops. So now we, we have some images here of from, from Claire's video, okay? So now um, we're gonna go down to the bottom of the, of the screen here and then there's the editor. So we, we were over here, the file thing. The second one from the left is the editor. So we're gonna go over here and uh, then we're gonna go, oh, excuse me here, media. Tools. Here they go. Here and over to here, uh, we got media pool. So, so we got yeah, there's two tabs at the top here. It says media pool. So they call it a media pool instead of a uh, a video editor. So um, let's let's the, the thing the thing with the, let's go back to her video script, which I'll pull open because Clara was working on, on a video script for us. And, oh, welcome. Um, and I'm going to open this up. And, and the structure of the video script is that we have, um, uh, I want to backtrack. I'm backtracking a little bit here, just so you understand where 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 we're going here. Um, I am going to show her, show you all your, her script here. You had it on an email. <clears throat> uh, do, do you see, see the Google Docs? Anyway, uh, I'm trying to find her script here. Uh, Claire. So my plan was to have us open for the video. Okay. So do you, is there one, do you see the video script here? Yes. Okay. Yes. And so, thanks, Lori. Um, this, this is the script that we, we have like a little, little thing that we, um, she has video clips here 
uh, that um, that they explain what she's what she's putting together here. Um, and uh, her script that we work, Lori and I worked together with to get approved. So she, but the important thing is here that it, it has audio and video. Okay. Uh, and, and, and that's the structure that you use in the video script to, to, to move this forward. And, and, and looking at this, it's not perfect, but it's, it's a structure that you want this image with that text, this image with that text, this image with this text. So let's go back to the video editor. Let's go and make sure we got the right screen here. So here is her Here is her script. And let, let, let's take a listen to it. Um, oh, oh, let's make sure it's not going to share. Share computer sounds. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's, let's share this and, and, and I want you to. Um, Instructors, we are creating fundraising events to share. Can you guys hear that? Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay, 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 we'll, st we'll start at the though. beginning here. Uh, and we'll start to share here. I am experiencing panic attacks, not wanting to get out of bed, and nearly lost my job. Discovering simple well-being practices, I created a vibrant, happy me. I was compelled to write a book, and I was stuck. Within the first three months of the team management and leadership program, with its structures to create teamwork, I was able to complete my book. 20% of all book proceeds will be contributed to the underserved with free community classes or by partnering with local nonprofits. Together with a team of yoga and dance instructors, we are creating fundraising events to share these practices that relieve anxiety and depression. We are committed to expanding our partnerships and increasing our reach. We are looking to partner with you. Join us in empowering and uplifting your community. Okay, so there's, there's her script. Okay, and she uh, put this together last quarter, and what I want to say is, she, she, Clara, unfortunately she isn't here, but I know that she continues to play her game, and I know it's probably a bigger game now than it is here at this t point of time that, that she created this script. So w with that in mind, you know, don't, don't let your game continuously be expanding to stop you from putting together a video draft. Because you probably think, oh, my game is getting bigger. I want it to be bigger yet. And then include this, and then I'll put together a video. Oh, I want it to be bigger yet. It's, it's um, video editing. I want to make sure that you, that you get the point that it's, it's, a, it's a today conversation and not a someday conversation. Because you can change it. And this is the point of this, this webinar, is to change it into something that you can change. So. Uh, with with this, we will go back to her. Oops. Um, oh, where did it go? Share. Uh, go back. Oh, I was in the wrong screen anyway. So, so you guys have been looking at my this thing here. So this this is the um, the script here. So we're going to go through and go back to the editor here and share that. Let me minimize this. I apologize for my troubles with 
mastering Zoom here. So do you guys see the black screen with the video editor? Yes. Okay, good, thanks. Thanks, Lori. So, um, so you have this. The, the, you, I, what what I did is I, I, there was a, there, there, there was her script here and the green bar at the bottom here is her script. I thought you were looking at this, but you're not. So this is the, at the bottom here is the needle. On I am experiencing panic attacks, not wanting to get out of bed and nearly lost my job. So that, that's the first part of her script. When we go right. back to, um, uh, uh, let me go change the screen here again. We go back to this. So, we, we so I, I am experiencing, you see that I am experiencing panic attacks, not wanting to get up and nearly lost my job. Okay. And she has video clip curled and ball. Lori? Yeah, so that's what I wanted to get to. So we, so we have, so for everybody making the, the videos, you have this script template that has the audio video. So what, what's being said and what image goes with it. So do you have like on the DaVinci Resolve, is there a place or you just have a, a split screen for the script template? so that you know which image you're using for which uh okay like how do okay. you know which image to pick okay so I'm, I'm i'm just getting to that thanks um and yeah. this um let me go back to ah, back here there so this is this is my media pool here to the side here and can you see the little scrolling thing of images here so there is a yes. video of yes. her curled up. And, and I want to go in here, this, this, this thing that's moving across here, uh, I want to drop a, a little marker there. These, these blue things are marker, so. So, so then now we got video here. Oh. And where is it? I know it's here. Okay. There's Clara curled up. Oop, sorry about that. There's, oop. So we got this, this video clip of Clara curled up in the ball. And of course, we're not going to need all of that. So um, we just need the first few seconds of that. When, when she's saying that she's, um, and I don't know why it did that. That, that did not work. And your pal, your pal in video editing is the on boot, undo button. And so we're just gonna drop it in there. Right there, okay. So now when we play this, let's just play this a little bit here. I am experiencing panic attacks, not wanting to get out of bed and nearly lost my job. Discovering simple well-being. Okay, so this isn't perfect. So what we're gonna do is move this needle around. So she's in her chair. She obviously set up her camera and um, So what we're going to do is take this clip and we're going to swoosh, swoosh through through dra dropping and dragging. We have the video two. It's on the video two thing. So we're we're smooshing it down to size. So we're kind of and we got the other end here, way at the other end. So this video clip is really long and longer than we need. So what we're doing is just dragging the end over. And then we're going to slide that over there. And we're gonna slide right to that marker. 
because that marker is when she's talking about being in her chair. Okay, so let's let's um, play this, and the screen up here to the right is her video, uh, the upper right corner, and this uh, this is the audio track. We're just going to uh, play it and see what we got so far. Okay. Mm -hmm. We are committed to expanding our. Okay, so let's go play it over here. Experiencing panic attacks, not wanting to get out of bed, and nearly lost my job. Okay. Discovering simple well. Okay, so now she is discovering simple meditation. Uh, and I'm, I have to bend over here, apologize, so I can't read this too well. So now she's discovering simple meditation. So we're gonna put that right next to that. And again, we need to slide that over. And, oh, that's no good. The undo button is our is our friend. So we have uh, a video clip of her meditating right there. Okay. So we're just I'm just grabbing it and and up here, this is the edit button. Um, the edit button, and we're just sliding it across. Oops. To edit this. Ah. All right. So let's just play this through here. Her, her, her. Because we want. So I put this little blue marker to know that that she's curled up in the ball, and then now we're going to do the next step and have her. Uh, meditation, meditation, okay. And we want to know how long to make this part. So let's go back to here and play. I really lost my job. Discovering simple well being practices, I created a vibrant, happy me. I was compelled to write a book and I was stuck. So, um, so how do you, how do you how to write a actually make the marker? Like, how do you? Okay, good question. So there, you, you see these little blue things here? Yeah. So, so I, I have a, a book. Okay. I have a, okay, I have, um, okay, let's, let's play this through and I'll show you here. Discovering simple well-being practices, I created a vibrant, happy me. I was compelled to write a book. Okay, so here you can see Stop. down here. Uh, I'm going to expand a little bit here. But this is the voice track here. Oh, right. This green green thing here, and uh, so then she's talking about different things at different times. So I'm gonna, the, the, add a little blue marker here. Yeah, and how do you add the marker? You click on this little blue thing right here. Okay. There's Just a blue where, one and there's a... Like wherever you stop. Yeah, okay. yeah. And, and the little red, the red, it might be hard for you to see this over the internet, so I apologize. I can, see it. can you see it? We can see it. Okay, yeah. good, thanks. So then, so then there's a little blue thing in the timeline right. here. So we're going to okay. slide this over here. Just to the end, and it's going to stop at the blue. Yeah, it's going to it's go, gonna and then we're going to stop it at the blue, red. exactly. Uh, okay. And there's two ways of cutting this a little bit. There's also a, I see. there's also a, uh, this thing looks like a razor blade, and you can use yeah. that and actually cut 
your video clip. And be really careful with this razor blade thing because you don't want to cut the voice track. You want to keep that in peace. So turn that off. And so we'll delete that. So, so now what we have, move this back to the beginning, is this. I'm experiencing panic attacks, not wanting to get out of bed and nearly lost my job. Discovering simple well-being practices, I created a vibrant, happy me. I was compelled to write a book okay. and I was stuck. With so now, over here to the side. Oops. So, so I got, can you like just pause for a second and anybody who is actually creating a video uh, for Team and Beyond, are you uh, following along with this? So this I mean, is Yeah, this any is questions good. so far? Yeah, this is really great because you're actually showing how you, we took the script, right, which we've been working on, which is our template to create a video what the you put the voice track in and then you start pulling down the images <clears throat> that you want to uh portray to go with your your words and so right now we have two images going from you know the first to the second so it's pretty clear that this will just continue on till the end right right so so this is a good start like you did one and then stopped and then you have the second one now does anybody have any questions so far uh, actually i do this is douglas can you hear me yep here you douglas yes okay great thanks yeah i'm in los angeles and so and in looking at all of this this is my first introduction to even looking at how to do audio and video and how to make a film so i know i'm going to be needing a lot more information about how to do all this so is there a youtube video or something that can also okay help? perfect perfect question so um so let's go back um here please oh let me go that new share let me click this over so Google Chrome. So I'm going to show you. Uh, a, uh, video script. Can you see see this uh, Google Doc here? Yes, and I'm, I actually have a paper copy of that in front of me right now. Okay, so on on the invite, I put a link to the DaVinci Resolve website. So what you need to do is look at that. And ah oh shoot, let go. You go to that link, that website here. Okay, do you guys see the um, the website here? Yes. Okay, good, cool. Um, so what, what there is, is little training videos, introduction to editing. This video is far more better than, um, than what I could ever produce in my whole life. And the thing is that, um, uh, in the blue here, it says download project file. So it's going through a sample editing exercise. And it also gives you the sample that you can edit. It's, 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 it's incredible. And then at the bottom of this page is a link to download the software. It says DaVinci Resolve 15 free. So there it is, free. You can't, you can't go wrong there. Um, and what there is, is there's a whole wealth of, of, of DaVinci Resolve questions and things here. So um so that's a good question and and um yeah
and I need yeah so if you are planning on editing your own videos then using this this is awesome so definitely do the YouTube uh, training and um, and then this is this is a practical right. webinar that that Bob's going through like <clears throat> an example of an actual video that we're creating for the weekend. Got it. Great. Thank you. That's helpful. Yeah. And then the thing is here with this project here, that is we're going to do a file. Okay. Cool. Here, right. And then save project. Uh, I don't know where it's saving it, but we're going to call it um, Clara. Probably share it, save it in the original file folder. And you could save this in like a Google Drive and then share that with someone else that can actually help you. All right. Great. Thank you. Yeah. Anyone else have any questions? I, I see some of you are on mute, so I'm, I'm going through and unmuting some of you here. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah. And I, I, so Lori, do you have anything to add? I'm, I, mean, I need a quick, take a little break here and you can, you can talk for a while. <laughs> I apologize. Wait, hold on. I, I lost, wait, hold on. I lost uh, video portion. Okay. I got, I, oh wait, here, let me see if I can get back on. Hold on. I'll be right back. Here I need I to quick use the restroom. I, I so, since okay, I slept so through my alarm clock. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm still in breakdown over here. <laughs> All right, oh my God, I must have been so okay, tired. So who, who, who is on the call? Um, I don't know who's on the call or on the webinar here that is at, that that has been creating a script and would like to start putting their images together like so who has questions as to how to, to um maybe what images they want to use and or or anything so far if you have any questions not 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 about the actual editing um technical part that will be for Bob. So I'm not sure. Can anybody hear me? Because I don't, I'm not the host. No, I can I'm not on you. mute. Okay, so everybody can hear me? Yeah. Okay, so so the only, the only face I'm seeing is Douglas. Douglas, are you the, uh, the person who wants to create uh, 10 videos? Was that you? Oh, uh, yes, that's else? correct, Larry. Okay, great. Nice to see you. Nice to so see I'm you. So I'm glad I, so good. So, so I get your, um, your intention of really getting proficient in creating videos, right? Yes. So it's a good start for you. And <clears throat> your videos will be a little bit different you are going to create a video for the team weekend. So this is the structure that's being used for the team weekends, being that we use that script template. So the very first thing we ask of before we even like, you know, uh, assign a coach or start creating feedback is that we get a script, right? So the very first, part is to create a script for your game about your game and what you're up to and how you want your video to look and then from that once the script is aligned for our purposes then we we start having you the video creator gather images Right, so you'll go out in the world with your video camera, whether it's a um, 
your iPhone or some other equipment. And we did do a webinar last week on different um, lighting, microphones, and uh, camera equipment, or, or like, you know, what's free, what's inexpensive, what the advantages and disadvantages of each, um, you know, the, 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 the apparatus to actually create your images. So that was last week's webinar, which was really great. If anybody would like to see it, there's a link to that that we can share with you. And now from here, so this is the third portion, right? The third portion, the final portion, is getting those images onto a folder that then becomes your actual video draft. Right, so that's today's presentation. Perfect. And so, um do you have do you have your images for your because we don't have a script for you yet uh, correct douglas so uh no i do not have the images yet and i get that i need to do a script and get that approved and um i do need the link to the uh webinar on uh the lighting and the microphone and so forth yeah and there's the first yeah we can so request that of bob and then we can anybody else as well who is on this webinar that would like to have the link i think it's on the team and beyond uh page but bob when he gets back he will yeah i'm back he can he can okay so tell everybody where they can get the link for the first okay. it, it, the first webinar was invite, there should be a, a link to a youtube video of the past webinar so you'll be um you can uh watch it from there all right so tell so just say clearly again because i was okay okay here. so let's let me go here and we'll do another screen share uh, so um you see the website and then we'll go into my gmail here So, oops. Uh, I'm to the set. Okay, so we got we got the email here. And it says, uh, join our webinar and webinar recordings. So there's webinar recordings here on the, can you see that? So where it says webinar recordings? Yeah. So we see that. That's great. The email. So video makers toolbar. It's the top one here where we talk about, and then this will take you right to um, the webinar. So welcome everyone. And that'll be that's the webinar on YouTube. So it's been posted on on YouTube, and that I sent the link uh, on okay. the screen here. All right. I got it. Yeah. Great. Thank yeah. you. Any any so other there's, questions? Uh, there's there's a series of three webinars, right? The first one is about the script. The second one is about the tools, being lighting, microphones, cameras, angles, all of that. And then this third one is now how to put all of your, your script, your images into an actual video. Okay. Perfect. So this should, yeah. Okay. So continue on Bob. Perfect. Thanks Lori. Uh, so yeah, this is, this is the final, the final part of that. And um, yeah. Any, any other questions? Oh, this is Douglas. I'm good for now. Thank you. That's All right. Really cool. All right. And I, I don't so think let's go back. Okay. 
Yes, Lori? Let's go back to your Da Vinci now and, okay. and carry on with the video. Okay. And I'm not going to run this too much longer. And let me make sure I got the. Sh so is there um, maybe it don't instead of like, you know, carrying out all the images for Clara's video, then we can see what how else can you edit it like you can put in some music and or uh, some how you trans you go from transition from one image to the next if you want to add some special effect something like that right so yeah you can within within the software uh there are um uh up here you can see a top here it says media pool you can do effects so you can add crossfades oops uh, oh, and i'm having troubles adding them now how about a text because a lot of times in our videos People, uh, creators want to put facts in there or, okay. um, so sometimes we want to add a text. Okay, perfect. And it needs to be large, right? So that right. everybody can see it in the weekend. So, so how do text, you, so, uh, So what I got here is text. Uh, good, good question. So there's different things here. There's titles, there's video transitions. Up here in the upper right corner is video transitions, audio transition, text, and generators, which I don't know what that is. But here you can see the side here. This is your final project, final product. You got text here. You can click into here and this menu comes up and you can edit what your tech, text says. So like, Let's say the, the text would be 4,000 books sold. I don't know how many books you sold, but we will say that 4,000 books sold. S-O-L-D. S-O-L-D, yeah. Okay, so, okay, good, cool. So then you can, you can drag this down, you can see down here at the bottom, we can drag that on top of the thing here. And the image of the book, and it says 4,000 books sold, okay? Yeah, so say we don't want it in the middle of the book, yeah. then how do we move it? If you go back to the editor here, you hit return a couple times and it starts moving down. Or, or, or on the top, because for our purposes, we want the, the text on the top, correct? Uh, this is a, that's for uh, captioning, for subtitles. You want the subtitles on the top, but if you have text in your video, it could be anywhere. And the reason why we have subtitles on the top, this is sort of, uh, is, um, is, is not all uh, team weekend rooms are created the same. So they may not have the, uh, not people in the back of the room may not be able to see over through the heads of the people in the front of the room and see the bottom of the, the video text. So if it's like a caption subtitles, we want the, the subtitles on the top. But if it's like text, it goes with your video, we want on the bottom. And let's say if you want this text bigger, um, there's, uh, there's a size slider here, a little bigger. So 4,000 books sold. So say, say you want to have like the book and then have it kind of uh, move into 4,000 books sold to make it just have some kind of special transition effect or something. Yeah, so you can you could shorten the, the length of the text a little bit here. So when you play it, we'll go back to playing it here. 
is I created a vibrant, happy me. I was compelled to write a book and I was stuck. Okay, so obviously if she was compelled to write a book and she was stuck, it would not be the right image to, to say, um, time to say that to she- To show the book. The, to show the book, yeah. But, right. the but book. The, the, that's- oh, sorry. But it's not a, in, in DaVinci Resolve, it's not a big deal because you can just slide the book to wherever you want it, the, the timeline. Right. So there's a few, there's a few images in there that need to be added to go with her words, right? So it's like the ha vibrant, happy me. So we want to see her vibrantly and happy. Right. And then she talks about like she was stuck to make the book until she joined team. And then she was able to complete her book in three months. So right. there's a couple images missing, but then, but for these purposes on today's uh, webinar, let's just, you, I like the book image and the text and then yeah. so that you can see transitioning and text and maybe add some music or if there's anything else that we would use in our videos, um, there's not a, there's not that much more, really, right? Right. And, uh, that's perfect. Perfect, perfect, minute. perfect question, Lori. Um, yeah, because let's say you create your old video and you have mismatched images or whatever. So with DaVinci Resolve, you could go, okay, it's not a big deal. Let's change, let's change things around a little and have different images here. Um, because we want to see an image of you vibrant and happy. Was it? And, um, and when Clara created her video, she had no vibrant, happy images at that time. But it's not, it's not that it's bad. It's like, oh, well, I'll just get some and put it in there. Not a big deal. Because um, we had images of everything else. So, um, uh, so yeah, that's, that's where um, the, Editing software is perfect because um, you can add that in. Any other questions at this time? I, I got to excuse myself again and I'll be right back. So, Laura, you can carry on. <laughs> okay. So, yeah. So, it's, it's actually what I would request of, of each of you who are going to create a video is to be really um, aware that the script is your is your video it is like the skeleton frame of your video just like the script in a movie is going to be you can't have a movie or film without a script right so the script that's why the script has to come first and it is super important to have all the elements that we require for the team weekend. Now, if you're using this for something other purposes, that's fine. So you'll have your own intention for something else and you'll want to have all of your points in there, right? Before you go ahead and start shooting your video for whatever purpose. So for team weekend purposes, it's a team video. It's showing teams and teamwork. It's showing who you are, what you're up to, what inspired you to play this particular game, um, what the impact is, how you created teams and teamwork to expand your game, how the team management leadership program gave you something to be able to play this, right? That you wouldn't have played before or some aspect that you got from being on team management leadership in the team management leadership program. So for our purposes, our video, that's what we're showing. We're completing the weekend with acknowledging the games in the world and what we're up to in team, creating teams and teamwork. So it's super important for all of you to have in your script teams and teamwork who's on your team and how is it how is it moving your game and um and then having images 
of your teams and teamwork. That's what we really are looking for. So the impact that you're making in the world by playing your game and how you created your game with teams and teamwork. So creating the images in your head and then going out and filming that, whether it's in still shots or it's in video, is very, very important to have that part, okay? I was just talking about the importance of images of showing teams and teamwork. Right, right. So, um, so yeah, what, what Lori, what, um, what, what, what uh, Clara had here is a, is, is a video of your, um, of a team meeting here. So, So yeah, she 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 filmed a, a a meeting here for teammates here. The team management and leadership program, with its structures to create teamwork, I was able to complete my book. So this is a team meeting, and obviously, here that you you'll see that that there's there's audio here that we don't need her talking. We just need the video. So there's two clips. I don't know if you can see. Uh, the two clips here at the bottom, there's the, um, um, the, the, the audio part here. And the thing is that you can, you can just take the audio part of that. And there's a little a line here. Do you see that? You can move that down so that's completely turned off. So what is that doing? It's turning it off. It's turning off the audio, so we all because she she filmed the video of herself her team meeting in a in a crowded restaurant. We don't need the crowded restaurant sound. We just need her her dialogue. Right. right. That oh, that's a great point. So within so the in first the, three months the of the team last week, yeah. So part of sorry. Go ahead. Yeah, no, 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 no. Go ahead, Lori. Yeah, so it's real important when you're when you're um, filming your your shots, when you're taking your shots, not to have background noise. And right. um, so that's what. That's well, what and, and if you right do there. have when you film your dialogue, it's important not to have background noise. If you have background noise in your shots, it's not a big deal, actually, because we, we can you can turn it off or turn it on right so this is yeah so this is like magic so he's turning off the actual footage audio and in place we're using a voiceover of the, the video creator uh, generating her script right so that's it's it's so that's a point also to bring up is that when you're generating your script and you're creating your your video you do not need to be in front of the camera saying hi my name is Lori Gallagher and my game is uh you know for me dancing with the seniors and here I am like so you don't need to be generating your script on front of the camera you can do a separate um right voice and, memo. And yeah yeah you can do like a voice memo or something like that and uh uh it's just it's just an, the audio track you'll see here is this thing here uh yes so you have a separate voice audio track from which, which, which is the violet thing way. here i changed the color is it, it which, which could be just her you talking like a voice memo app we always talk about voice memo app you can right. use that to to um put together your video and to add generate. images to it right so is everybody clear about that because that's really simple and important. Right. 
Okay. So go ahead All right. and move on. All right. And well, what time um, is it? Yeah, it, I mean, we've been going for about an hour, and I just want to wrap it up with some questions or anything. Yeah, I need to any. get going too. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Laurie. So, any other questions out yes. there before we complete this? All right. So, I, I appreciate everyone sticking in here um, among my, amongst my, my breakdown of not sending an alarm clock. Um, and um, so if we'll, we'll, we'll have more, we'll have a, a follow up webinar of all technology uh, regarding video making. Um, do it next Sunday. And, and for, for those who might may have missed this one or, or um, have any last minute questions. All right. Right, and also there there have been two or three other uh, webinars for editing. Right, but I'll have to say this one is very very. Uh, I think it's really clear the way you did it, Bob. So I really acknowledge you giving up whatever you need to give up just to like get into to how this is being created because sure. I think it's it's fairly clear how to. Um, you know, set up for our purposes, how you went from the script to the template, you know, creating the, the, the audio track and then laying down your, your visual images, um, transitioning from one to the next, adding text, um, you know, and, and that. So thank you for, yeah. for that. It's a very clear picture here it, as it, well. It, it, this is a webinar I've been dreaming to put together for years, literally. Because, <laughs> because people get so stuck. They get stopped. They don't have yeah. an editor. And it's not that hard. And and the thing yeah. I want to, the second point, it's not that, it's not, it's a little tricky. Like any other new software, it's a little tricky. And there's the undo button if you make a mistake. And, um, and if you can't finish the project, you can save what you create with someone else and they can help you. Yeah. So this is a really nice program. And um, thank you for sharing that with us. Okay. All Any right. Other? So I am. Go ahead. Why don't you. And just to make sure everyone's complete. Uh, right. This is Douglas. Uh, I just want to say thank you very much, Laurie and Chris. This has been very helpful. And I'm. Yeah. I, the other resources I can tap into on my own and look forward to uh, presenting my 60 second audio clip to you guys. Okay, right. and send us your script first. Okay, yeah. we'll do, I'll start with that. Thank you. Okay, thank you. All right, well, thanks, thanks right. everyone, and everyone have a great day, okay? And yep. be in communication if you have any uh, questions or anything that you need help or su support around. All right. Perfect. All right. Okay, great. Have a good day, y'all. Have a good bye -bye. day, yeah. Bye-bye.